everyone. I hope you're having a wonderful day. I have this box from Sephora. It is missing an item. Um, because why can't they just send everything together? But it is what it is. In here I have, and I've been stalking this, so I'm going to bring it to you guys. I just want to make sure that everything is going to see in the box before I get rid of the box. I'm sorry for all the noise. So here I have the Sephora. What does that say? Moving lights. The advent calendar. Let's see all the products on the back. 24 surprises, makeup, skincare, bath, and accessories. Um, exclusive surprise on the last day. So let's see what it looks like. I'm just going to slip. There's some tape in the front here. I'm going to slip that. I saw the UK one, and that one really looked good, but ours are never the same here in the U.S. that they get in the UK, which... Oy. There's like tape everywhere. Let's just untape all of that. Hopefully I have it all. This is, yep, yeah, it opens, opens up like this. And like I said, it does give you a little peek at the back. Um, I'm trying to think how much this was. $50? $50, I think. Um, I honestly don't remember. I think that's what it cost. In the meantime, I'm trying to like search out um, these. So let's just see what's involved in here and uh, see what we get. So this is Love the Lift. And these are all Sephora products. So what are you? Instant Curl and Lifting Volumes. So this is a mascara. Not bad. We're going to just leave them in the slots probably. So number two. The biggest problem is finding them to share them with you. Let's see what number two is. And this is the um, Clean Skin Gel Cleanser Toner Face, Eyes, and Neck. Right here. So that's not horrible. Let's put you back. Do I want to put them back? Yeah, I think so. So number three is here. I'm just going to open them. I'm not going to keep on lifting the calendar up. And, oh, okay. Cute little scrunchy right there. That's number three. On the fourth is... Get this stuff out. Sometimes they're difficult. This is not too, too bad. So what is this? A white nail polish? Clean white nail polish. Oops, oops. That's good for, like, if you wanted to do your own, you know, tips white, your own French manicure. That would be nice. I don't wear white. I'm a more of a dark color polish girl. Always have been. So we're going moving on to five. What are you? Five is a mask, it looks like. Quenching and plumping effect. Right here. Should I take these out? I don't know if I can get that back in or not. We'll find out if I can get it back in or not. Okay. So that was five. Day five. Day six. Is. Um, what are you? Bubble bath and shower gel. So it's one of the little packs. Which is not bad. That's enough for a single use. Number seven is, oof, I should get my magnifier out, lip liner, to, lip liner, right here, little minis, this is probably red, it is a red lip liner, I wonder if we have a red lipstick, let's get that back in there, so that's number seven, um, Where's number eight? Hmm. I hate that. You, oh, I see. You, you can look at a calendar and you can't spot it. We have another mask, which I'm not mad at. Oh, no, this is not a mask. This is a cleansing wipe. 
hydrating wipes. Nice. Put that back in there. So that's eight. Nine I saw somewhere. So nine is over here. What do we have here? Some some little um, stickers. Could you you could put them on your face? You could put them on your nails too, and just put a good top coat on. I've done that before in the past. But number ten. What do we have here? Blackhead remover. You know. And this is, is this a nose one? Or is this just a one black adhesive strip patch? Nose strip. Okay. So that's 10. The 11th is, oh, a pair of tweezers. Nice. They're expensive. Happy to have them love getting tweezers and just because of the price of them they, they they are very pricey so i don't mind that right there 12 is over here we have anti-dark circle eye mask i'm getting some dark under my eyes from just from life this past year so i've, I've been using them like crazy that was 12. Where is 13? Okay. We have a top coat, a Sephora top coat. I can't get it out though. And this is a top coat, right? Shine and wear. Nice little top coat, which never am angry at that. I wish you was a top coat. <sighs> 14, where are you? Over here. Ooh, okay. Cute little emery boards. Looks like there's three of them in there. I like them. They're good when I do the dip to quick buff. Smaller ones I, I like better than. I have big ones, but I like the smaller ones. I have a few small ones better. 15 looks like we have more skincare. So this is um, coconut foot mask. Nice. Oops, I like that too. A little bit of paper session might be going on here. Let's see what's over here. What are you? Oops. Oh, we have like a little exfoliating glove. These things are so nice to, in the bath, um, you know, put your, you know, your body wash or whatever and really get in there and exfoliate. That's why I love the, um, Oh my god, what do they call it? Sponge gel. But that's not bad to have at all. I'm all about exfoliating when I'm in the shower. 17. We're up to. Let's see what you are. A little tiny one brightening eye cream. Let's see 18, so I don't have to hunt around. 18 is. Get it out. So this is a full size. Uh, retractable eyeliner right here it's just going to be brown yeah nice little brown eyeliner which i like so you can see the dark brown okay i love a brown eyeliner i'm just not into the blacks so that's 18 19 i see the masks so here we have moisture and smoothing lip mask another fun favorite i like those too 20 will you hair like little hair clips if i can get them out Difficult. these are nice they don't leave a mark like when you clip to do your makeup they don't um leave any mark whatsoever in your hair sometimes if you were to do it with something else um it will leave a mark Okay, 21. It's another skincare product. Let's see. This is All Day Hydrator. Okay. Not bad. 22 is a nail polish. So we have a white. We have the clear. I can't know if I can get this one out. Ouch. <laughs> There's 
going to use my blade to try to assist and get this one out. There we go. So you have a nice little red, which I'll probably share because I don't use red nail polish. I used to. I don't anymore. 23. Nice to get a lipstick. What are we? So we have one of them little skincare tools you know cold you can put it in the fridge but you know you rub it under your eye with your eye like serums and stuff like that that's nice to have 23 so 24 is supposed to be like a surprise bonus i don't know oh wow what is this a lip marker colored lip tint i don't know about that oh that is red I cannot even try that because I will not keep that. So that's not bad. So we have two full size products. I mean, the masks are full size, all that. So, uh, you know, the, the exfoliating glove, not bad. I mean, I'm not going to complain at all. I, I think it's a cute calendar. Um, every one of them is overpriced. A lot of times I like to wait till we get like closer to the holiday or right after the holidays and like so many if they're available and this one usually sells out if they're available you can get them for less than half price i keep my eye on macy's.com because usually as the holidays approach that they know they can't ship to make it to you by the holiday they drastically reduce them after the holidays they reduce the prices i've done quite a few um calendars um after so, um, you know, I don't know if I'll get any more to share. It just depends if something pops up that catches my eye. But um, I've been wanting to try this one for the last couple of years. And I just have not because I've gotten other ones. But I figured let me try this one and see. So here is what this one looks like. You know, that everything's open. So it's just, you know, a double-sided here. And then the back does tell you everything in the advent calendar which is nice if you're unsure, you know, you can read ingredients and things like that, which, you know, I'm not mad at, but cute little advent calendar. Um, and if you have gift cards or things like that, you know, that now's the time to, uh, to get something like that. So thank you all for watching. I greatly appreciate it. If you haven't already hit the subscribe button, I would appreciate very much if you would subscribe to the channel and hit the notification bell. Um, don't forget, I have a birthday card list. If anybody would like to join, the information is in my description box. You just have to email that specific email and give me your name, address, and your birth month only so that I can mail you out a birthday card for your birthday month. I would love to do that. I noticed a lot of people that I have on the list are no longer commenting on the channel, and I'm not sending out a birthday card if you if you have not commented in the last you know, four or six months. If I have not seen you at all, again, I'm not going to send you a birthday card. So I removed a lot of people from my birthday card list. So if anybody would like to join, join so that I can mail you a card. You know, that's something I do to, you know, say thank you to all of you. It, you have to be subscribed to my channel in order to enter giveaways. I do two a month at least. So, um, you know, it's free for you to hit that subscribe button. And if you are a current subscriber, you know, just verify that you are still subscribed. Check every once in a while because every once in a while, some of you are unsubscribed and, and some never come back as sub subscribed. And that's your choice if you choose to unsubscribe. But I still see you commenting all the time. So that tells me you're even not aware. Um, I know I'm guilty of it. I'll just go watch videos to the channels I watch and I don't look. But lately I have been looking because, you know, a lot of channels are complaining you know, you're down two subs, three, five, you know, and then two days later they're back. It's, I don't know what YouTube is doing. They just need to stop messing around and just leave us alone to do what we're doing. Now, if we're doing something wrong, that's, that's different, but I, I don't, I don't think most of us are doing anything wrong. We're just out here grinding and trying to do our best. And then, you know, it, it's just it's disappointing when you see you know, four subscribers less than you had the night before. And it's YouTube because these people are still active and commenting every day. So, and I know it's a YouTube thing and I don't let it get to me, but you know, it, it's disheartening. So, um, I appreciate all of you have a wonderful day and I'll see you all in the next video. Bye for now.